And now we take a look at some other stories from around Taiwan. Tests conducted by the Taipei Health Department on 25 randomly selected traditional Chinese medicine ingredients sold in the city found seven that failed mandated health standards, with some containing pesticide residue. The infringing products have been removed from store shelves, and the makers of other products with packaging that did not meet requirements have been ordered to take immediate remedial action. Following a $300 million NT dollar government subsidy for struggling local firms dependent on Chinese tourism, the Tourism Bureau has now set up six courses across Taiwan to teach Taiwan's travel operators how to retool around more domestic travelers and tourists from other Southeast Asian nations. Registration for the courses has so far been brisk. Subterranean air raid shelters built during the Japanese occupation period in Geelong have emerged as popular tourist destinations. The largest such shelter, located under Zhongzhen Park, has even hosted a range of small-scale exhibitions open to the public. And Geelong tourism authorities are hoping to use the special spaces to expand the coastal city's range of tourism offerings.